semispinalis muscles um i don't know how to differentiate that from just the spinalis and stuff just semi means half i guess i don't know anyways both innervated by the spinal nerve dorsal rami bilaterally extend eccentric stability four controlling lateral flexion to side opposite of contraction maintaining head posture maintain head posture because it goes into here and it's so long Okay, semispinalis capitis. So, capitis means it goes into the head, originates from the transverse processes. Look at how many, so many, of C7 to T6, and the articular processes of C4 to C6. I think you would just palpate the transverse processes because you can't really touch the articular ones. Anyways, then it goes up. It inserts at these finest processes about five to six segments above the origin and the occipital bone below the superior nuchal line. Yes, because that's supreme nuchal line. This is superior. This is inferior. Great. Uh, yeah, spinal nerve, dorsal rami is the innervation, extension, eccentric stability, controlling lateral flexion, maintain head posture. This is the muscle test, like everything else. Now, the cervices, obviously, the capitis goes high. Cervices is lower. It originates from the TPs of T1 to T5. And then it inserts into the spinous processes five to six segments above the origin and the spinous processes of C2 to C5. Again, dorsal rami, spinal nerve extension, eccentric stability, controlling lateral flexion, maintaining head posture. Um, the same muscle test. I have absolutely no tricks to remember this. I, I won't.